What's up, guys? Jonathan here with Denning Bros Gaming. Back, uh, what's this? In the past? Is that was called Into the Past. Into the Into the Past? Is into that what this is actually called? Uh, yeah, I think I think it's Into the Past. <laughs> That's gonna be. I don't but... even know what the game's called. <laughs> it's by Rusty Lake. It's been a great game so far. We really enjoyed it last week. Hope you enjoyed it. Joined by my fellow J brother Jacob. Yes, um, sir. That's me. The first episode. It's kind of just figuring things out. I was in the past. Jacob was in the future. Jacob was messing with the box. I was messing with the room. Now it looks like I have a box here. Oh, did you hit continue? Did yeah, continue? I hit continue. I hit continue. All right. All right. I'm not sure what's going I on. I see a room. Oh. I see it. I see like a different room. It's like I went to the future just a little bit, but not Jeez. fully. <laughs> like the graphics got better. <laughs> All right. Well, I pick. Oh, whoa. Oh. Uh, I'm getting stuck. All right. I got a note here. Oh, no. oh, this is cool. It's like where our rooms got okay. swapped a little bit almost. I'm I'm not like only on stuck on the box now. I can like actually explore the room. That's what I'm saying. I I'm like it seems like we're opposite because I'm kinda not necessarily stuck on a box. I could see a room in the background. And it looks like the room I was in, but it looks fancier now. And now I have a box that has instructions, so there's Welcome to Cubicle Device 002C. Resurrection. What have I done? Resurrection process. Transfer bone, Stop. flesh, Stop. and blood. Huh? Nothing. Okay. Uh, Resurrection process. Transfer bone, flesh, and blood into this device. This device holds the room of the person in the future. Verify connection by entering code. You have a code somewhere? Uh, I have yeah, one, I'm sure I have I one two, three, XYZ. Oh, yeah, I have that code. Hold on. I'm just kind of exploring. I'm a girl, by the way. I didn't know that. I was the girl the first one. I was Rose, so now you're Rose. We swapped or something. I don't know what happened. Between chapter one and chapter two, we, like, swapped. Okay. All right. Okay. Sorry, 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 sorry. I'll go to the... I'll go to the... I'll stop exploring. How many doors? Okay, here we go. Uh, you going through doors? No, 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 no. Not doors, but, like, okay. like walls, I meant to say. Uh, okay. okay. Um... <clears throat> So I have two like pieces of paper here. This one says resurrection process. Mm -hmm. uh, then there's like a list and it says connect with my past self check. Execute extraction program check. Execute power surge program to create golden cube check. Press and hold the up arrow button for 10 seconds check. Power resurrection tank. That one we haven't done. Uh, transport bone, flesh, and blood into resurrection tank. Not done and complete resurrection process. Mm. The other paper says communicate the following code. The code should be used on the cubicle device in the past. Yep. Are you ready for the code? Ready. Z, 1, X, 2, 3, Y. Okay. You know what I just realized? We're probably both rows. Yeah, maybe you're rows in the future and I'm rows in the past. Yeah, because like when I did this mirror and I saw myself, it said I have grown old. Uh, so this is like we're doing this. Like I'm giving you the same thing that you're giving me last time. So the, remember we had that three by three grid and they had those buttons you had to press in. Do you see that? Yeah. You know, you said like the keypad is like one, two, three, four, five, yep. six, seven, eight, nine. So yep. it's basically one, three... One, uh, one, three, four. All the ones on the right, all the ones on the left. Not, not, none of the ones in the middle. That makes sense, right? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. All right. Um. So, okay. So it says, person in the future places black cube in C9. Communicate code. Yep. I did. Oh, sorry. I did that. I figured that out by myself. Okay, and then I gave you the code. Did you put that in? All three yep. on the left and the right. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And then some stuff showed up on the black cube, and then some, and then that's it. it. Says person in the future turns switch and communicates pointers: red, white, black. Yep. Okay, that happened. Yep. I pushed the button. The is there's a clock, right? Are you looking at the clock? I don't see a clock. 
Okay, do you see something with like ticks, like as a clock? Like as if it was a clock, you oh, see ticks. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so the black one is on the 11. The red one is on the 1. And the white one is on the 3. Okay. I'm looking into the lens. Oh, I see you're, you're old and I see the black demon. Yeah, yeah, it's scary, it's scary. You're so old. Alright, calm down there. Okay, I got something. You're, you're me. You're me. I'm you. I you're me. I got a music key. Oh, yeah, but I found a glass and a box of matches. Did the code move or anything? Or, or is it like the... Do I have the to hit right? a, No. Do I have to hit a button or something? Because there's like a button. Three buttons. One with bone, one with flesh, one with blood. blood. I don't know yet. I have a music key. That's all I got so far. Oh, here it goes. It looks like it goes here. Can you give me the key? Somehow? No, open something. Okay, now I got like a piano with letter with uh, C, D, E, F, G, A, B. Uh, and then I see 78.3. Is there like a radio? That sounds like a radio number. 78.3. Yeah, there is a radio. How did you know? How did you know? How did you know? It just looks like a radio number. 78.3. Must give you like a letter, like a alpha letters for me to play on the piano. Wait, 78.3? Got yeah. it. A, G, A, B. All right, uh, 114.3 KOA. Just kidding. <laughs> Hold on, this is this uh, 78.3 is laying down a sick beat. I'm gonna have to wait for this song <laughs> to get over. Okay, 114.3 C D E G. This is like classical jazz right now. Okay, 103.7. E D E C. This one's not bad. Eighty nine point one. B A G A. This is like just piano, piano solo. Okay, got a tooth tooth key. Ew, here we. Oh, I I see the demon climbing the wall. What? He's like farting. You, Jonathan, I'm not gonna <laughs> lie, you scared me so bad because like the demon's like, he's trapped in this little portal thing. If I turned around and he was on the wall, I might have <laughs> just pooped my pants. I don't know. <laughs> he was like, when he was walking, it sounded like he was farting or like maybe he was like slimy, but it was like, it was gross. Okay, I got a tooth key. I have a slot, there's a slot in it that has the tooth in it. The same, looks just almost like the box I did in the first chapter, but there's a key slot next to it. So let's see if I have the key in there and turn it. Okay. Okay. I see like one, two, three, four, five, six boxes that are separated into threes, like vertical. You know, uh, uh, three boxes that are separated into vertical. So, no, so like there's, well, there's like one, two, three, about. four, five, like six rectangles yep. and they're cut into thirds. Yep. Okay. <laughs> I see which I know what you're talking about. That's a better description. It takes me a second to think of a description. That's the tism. I mean, like, but yeah, we're 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 connected, Jonathan. We're the same person. I know, we're I know, I know, I know, I know. Give me a vague description, and I will find it. Okay, uh, so uh, some of these are filled in, so I guess, I guess I'll tell you which ones are filled in. So starting okay. from the top, the uh, the one the one on the right. Yep. The one on the left. Wait, hold middle. on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait. So the one at the very top is where? The furthest to the right. Okay. It's filled. It's filled in. The set, one after that, the first to the left is filled in. Okay. And then middle, middle. Okay. Left and then right. I got a tooth. Okay. Well, I didn't get a this tooth. Is the tooth I got some chalk. Okay. But there's a giant tooth in here. The heck? Okay. It's like a vacuum. I can't pick up the giant tooth, but okay. What's next? Um, I don't know. I feel like you gotta give me some sort of instruction. Uh, there's a chalkboard. Can you write on the chalkboard? I did write on the chalkboard. And it wrote... One, two, three, four, five... Eighteen symbols. Eighteen symbols? Yeah. And then in the bottom left, there's another another code. 
like the X Y Z and one two three. Okay, yeah, that's what I needed. Okay. Okay. Ready. Uh, X three Z one Y two. All right. Okay, I've got a note here. I'll read it to you. When I lay in my coffin and my eyes become white, my soul will turn to turn black. Use the cube to connect to the future. Bring me bone, flesh, and blood. Okay, so in this letter, there's some words that are underlined. Is it coffin, eyes, and dark soul or whatever? Coffin, eyes, soul, cube, future, bone, flesh, blood are all underlined. Say that slower if you need me to. Those eighteen okay. is eighteen letters. Do you see like do they are they like jumbled I, up? I do. I they're jumbled up. I see like I see the coffin, the cube, the eyes, the soul, blood, bone. I'm guessing that's flesh. Flesh and future. I could just tell you like these things in order from left to right, top to bottom. I don't know if that'll help you or not, actually. I mean, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. I don't know if you're supposed to, you're supposed to organize them or something. Can you touch them or anything? I guess I haven't tried. No, I cannot. Uh, cause I... Oh, there's a butterfly. Where's my butterfly? Just flying around. Can I catch it? Oh, it's literally a butterfly flying around. I can't catch it. Um... Yeah, I'm not. I I'm just not see really it underlined, but I'm not. Oh. <clears throat> Maybe is do you have to like put them in an, a certain order or something? I don't know. Or is there like a number code? Like coffin would be number two. Cube would be number six. Flesh would be number nine. Bone would be eleven. Eyes would be twelve. Blood would be not see anything that looks fifteen. Dark soul would be sixteen. Yeah, I don't know, is there something that you need to do or Oh, I can circle certain things with the chalk. Okay. Okay. So okay, tell me all of them again. I bet if I circle all of them something will happen. Coffin, eyes, okay. soul. Cube. Soul? Yeah, soul. Okay. Cube. Cube. Future. Oh, I don't know what. Oh, found it. Bone, flesh, blood. Bone, flesh. Blood. Oh, I got a hammer out of it. Okay. Okay. I don't know what to use the hammer on, though. Oh, maybe this. Haha, -ha, I'm so smart. Oh, sakes. That, I used... There was this that, is so cool. Go ahead, sorry. That big tooth, I used the hammer to crack it, and then I picked it all up with this uh -huh. vacuum, which is now going through this tube, and it's being sent... Got it. <laughs> oh, that's cool. So you know how like that black soul was just like in the, uh, in the in like that little tank floating there. Mm -hmm. When I cracked the tooth, it made a whole bunch of little bones. And I sucked it up with a vacuum. The vacuum went into that tube, and now there's a skeleton. It's not just a black soul. Oh. All right. Are, are you ready for the clock thing again? Uh, clock thing. Uh, like the ticks, the white. Oh, right, right, uh, right, black, right, right, right. Okay, yeah. Uh, the white one is one. The black one is four, and the red one is six. Okay, I see the... I just see the black guy again. Oh, I see the bones going into him. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. There's a rat. I still see your old self, but I see, yeah, he has bones Whoa! now. Oh, I just found a key because of the rat. Thanks, rat. Okay, I got a, I got a nut driver. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I saw there's this panel on the side of here that looks like where I would use a nut driver. Just Give like... me two seconds real quick. 
Just like you did. I'm taking off these screws just like you had to. Four of them. They're nuts, actually. I could take off four nuts. Oh. Alright, I got some gears here. I'm missing some gears, though. I'm missing three gears. Okay, I found... Uh, with... Okay, so with the key that I just found... Huh. Oh. Give me... Give me another second. All right, talk. Think out loud, sweet. So there's not so much silence. Sorry. Well, you, well, I was you were talking. Um. So I hit this rat, and it, it went into like a corner of the room. I clicked on it again. It found a key. I opened this uh, cabinet thing. There are three layers to it. The top layer has blueprints. Okay. Um. And. I don't know what to make out of these blueprints. Oh, okay, okay. Um, you say you're like just like stuck in a box, right? Yeah, I have a. Bo I opened the panel on the side of my box, kind of like what you did with the, had to do with the screwdriver. Inside yeah. mine, there's a gear, and one of them I can twist, and it's obvious that it has to twist at least three other gears. Gears, but I'm yeah. missing them. I don't know where they're at. Got it. Okay, so on that side, with the gears. Mm-hmm. There should be another gear in a hidden compartment on the left. On the left of what? On the left of the box. Because it's showing me, it's showing me side A and side B. Side B has like the three gears that you were talking about. Okay. Um, and then it shows, like, on the left side of the box, it has, like, a shaded area, and it says hidden compartment, and it says gear number three. And what does on... it look like? Is it broken up? Like, if I go to the left of where I'm looking at for the gears, I see three, like, cylinders in a circle, and then I see, like, the piano thing that I was playing. On side B, there's, like, three different compartments. Is that correct? Okay, yeah, I see three different compartments on the other side. So this, that's to the right of my gear thing. I see... Uh, there was bone here. I turned the key and that bone's gone. So now there's flesh, there's an ear, and there's blood. So maybe I have to do something to touch the blood? Some... All, I Some... don't see, like, anything that you were talking about. All I see are the gears and then, like, there's, like, three different boxes. The very top one looks like a cigarette. Uh, the middle one, it looks like a box with two rectangles inside of it, and the bottom one looks like a rectangle with the three gears inside of it. I'm trying to think. What do we do here? Anyways, on side A, mm -hmm. are there is there like three three different like uh, containers? I guess one in the top left, one in the bottom left, and then one taking the whole right side. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. So like the bottom okay. left, the bottom left was bone. The okay. Top left was blood, and the the right was off the whole right side is flesh okay so on that side that you were just talking about in between like the boxes on the left side you know what i'm talking mm -hmm. about if you like oh i see the, you see the hidden compartment yeah okay okay did you get a gear yes i got one gear okay okay on that same side uh the very right compartment the biggest one if you go like straight up there's okay. a compartment yep Did yep, yep. i see that here okay <clears throat> now on side b um again it's like in between the very two top compartments to the left aha uh -huh. okay yep 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 i okay. don't know how i didn't like notice that before but okay i have three gears okay. now Okay, now before you do anything, my middle shelf has a computer and it says press down button when the person in the past found missing gears in hidden compartments. So I will do that okay. in a second. This bottom okay. one, it has a coffee maker. And when I try and hit the power button, it says I need like actual coffee in there, which makes mm -hmm. sense because I have a burner and it said like I was missing heat. And so I put a match on it. So I now have a flame there and then it says missing coffee. So I'll need coffee at some point. Okay. Okay, I'll hit the down arrow now. Yep, I'll I'll put wait to see if that says something before I put the gears in there. <laughs> the 
doing anything? Um, there's three little symbols. There's a hook. There is what I would assume to either be an ear or a coin from Mario. You know how it has like the C in the middle. Mm -hmm. And then the one that's flashing are three lines that have one, two, <gasps> uh, five I ticks. Okay. On each of them, the first line, uh, the bar is moved all the way to the bottom, and the next two are moved to the second tick from like top to bottom. Do you have anything like that where you can move? So I, I put the gears in, I spun it, and it, it kept spinning, spinning, spinning. And like uh -huh. this hook came down and had like a little voodoo doll on it. Oh, and I tapped, I tapped the voodoo doll like three times. And then it fell to the table. And it, okay. I, I was able to grab the hook. Oh, I, I think I know. I think so on, on that box where there's something taking up the whole right side of the squares, you know? Oh yeah. There's an ear in that box and there's a lever that I could push to make a like a rope come down and up and there's a circle on the end of the rope and it looks like I can mm. attach this hook to that. Now I could oh, I thought you were gonna say you could attach the voodoo doll to the rope and like hang it. I was like Jesus. No, that's how I, that's how it came down from the ceiling here. <laughs> oh. But now I have a hook on the end of this rope and I think if I press the lever down it'll grab the ear. Did and lift it up. Inside the box. Okay, I think I see the lever things that you're talking about. So okay. I have three, three vertical like yep. levers. Yep. And there's lines up through the middles. Okay, yeah. So from left to right, I guess. Left to right, the first one's at the very bottom. Okay. And then the next two are at the second tick. All right, I that opened up another compartment in this in that spot and. I see arrows pointing different directions. Does that mean anything to oh, you? Oh, yes, it does. Okay. All There's right. Tell me when you're ready. Of them, right? Uh, yep. Okay. Right, left, left, up, right, down. Nice. What'd that do for you? There's another code, and there's also a hook in a top. Oh God. Oh no. Okay. Um, so that hook that I was talking about earlier, mm. there's a now a grid. It's a one, two. There's a seven by seven grid, and the hook is in the very top left. And I can use these arrows to move the hook to a certain spot. Okay. You say there was a code there or something? Oh, yeah, there is a code. Another like XYZ1231. Okay, all right. Ready? Uh, Y three X one Z two. Okay, I oh, see. Oh, I see how you're gonna be able to tell me to do this. How, how are you? How are, how do you see it? Well, like I tried to like move the hook and it moved it into a wrong spot and it took me back to the very beginning. So okay. you're gonna have to like tell me which directions to go. I don't. I so I see a one. Two and a three. I don't know how to. I'm guessing you're starting at one. I guess that's the only thing that makes sense. I guess, yeah. So when you move, does it move you like one click at a time? Yeah. Okay. Perfect. 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 All right. Ready? Yeah. Okay. You're gonna go down two clicks. Okay. To the right one click. That didn't work. Um. When I said when you went to the right, or or when you pressed right. When I pressed right, it didn't work, no. But going down two clicks was right. I'm trying to figure out. I, I would imagine you start here. Okay, what What do you... Uh, it's hard to say. Like, I was trying to say, what do you see? But do you see any numbers it's, indicate that you're where you're starting at? I'm guessing you're starting at one, but... No, there's no numbers at all. It's literally, you know, like those uh, 10 by 10 like blocks things that we played in like second grade? To like learn yeah. numbers. It looks like that, except it's a seven by seven. Yeah. Okay, so try to go down three clicks. No, that the didn't end. work. Okay. 
Like you go down two clicks, that work. Going down two clicks is fine. And you sure you're doing right? Right? Like, yes, I can't go left. Off. There's nothing to the left. It's like I'm like stuck here. Okay, maybe try down, down, up. Okay. Left. I can't go left. There's. Uh, I don't get what I'm looking at here. You can't go down three clicks, right? No, it takes me back to the beginning. Go down two clicks. Sure can. I'm trying to figure out what does this numbers mean? The numbers, Mason, what do they mean? What does it mean? Are you at the start right now? Yes. Can you go right? Yes. Oh. Now I can. I couldn't before. That's weird. Go right two more times if you can. No, I can't. So you, can you go right once again? Yeah. I'm can. trying to figure out where the heck you're at. So I'm at the very beginning. Let's let's. I don't know. We can do it like. So can you say where you're at on the three on the seven by seven grid? Where are you at? In the very top left. Okay, that helps a lot actually. I said okay. that before, like twice. Uh, I guess I missed it. I guess I missed it. I've noticed when I was editing the first video, I missed some things you said because you were, you said the answer and I did it wrong or I asked you the question again. Okay, this is easy now. Okay. Oh my god. So go right. Down. Uh, right three. And then you're going to go down one, two, three, four. And then to the left one, up two, to the left two, down two, to the left one, up two. Okay. Anything there? Uh, one bar filled up. Okay, so that was number one. Did you move anywhere or are you still at that spot? I'm still at that spot. All right, so you're going to go down two, okay. to the right one. Up two, to the right two, down three, to the right three. All right, another bar filled up. All right, now you're going to go to the left three, up one, to the right one, up one, two, three, four, five, to the left two. Down one, two, three, four. That didn't work. Wait, oh, where'd you get? Where are you at now? I'm in the very top left. Top left. Top left. Oh, uh, did are your bars emptied? No. Oh, thank God. Okay, to the right one. Down one. To the right one, two, three. Up one. To the right two. Down, one, two, three, four. To the left, one. And then up, one, two, three. Okay. That worked. Now I'm on a new screen. And it looks like that year is just hanging in a box. Do you touch the ear or something? Does it give him ears? Uh, no, I can't do anything. Oh my god. Yeah, that's not creepy at all. Is there a code under something? Uh, no. Um, I, like, kept looking around the room and this hook came down with this giant ear and I had to use- oh. I had to use a scalpel to cut off a piece of flesh. Yeah, that's what I had to do the first level. I see the the demon guy. He's in, just standing in the corner. One of the candles is unlit. He's just standing there. It's getting closer. Um, just a little FYI. I mm -hmm. um, 
that box that I was using in the first, uh, the first, uh, first time. Mm -hmm. I, uh, it had the number three on it, so I clicked it, and it said two, and I clicked it again, and it said, uh, one, and I clicked it again, and then it exploded. Oh. <laughs> so now I have dark powder. Okay. Um... I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do with this pile of flesh. I would think to give it to the man. But how? Can I just do this again? No. Mm. I don't need chalk anymore. I use that. I don't think I need this anymore. Ah, uh, let's see. How to give this guy some flesh? Can I do it like this? Can I, I throw it in the you, sink? I want to send you like a Snapchat of this guy. Kind of in the corner. Do you got any clues for me? To figure out how to get this flesh That's onto me. the guy? Huh? Um, no, I, I, I'm waiting for, like, a code or something. What'd you do to get the bone to him? Remember, I cracked it, and it, I sucked it up with the vacuum. Is there not, like, another vacuum thing? There's the same vacuum thing that I used before, but I can't drop the... Oh. Uh, I put the bucket on it? I made coffee. Out of the black powder? Yeah. Oh. Uh. You gonna drink it? No, well, hold on a second now. I'm figuring something out. There's a sink in here, and I found a glass earlier. And I could turn on the sink and run some water. And now I got a glass with water. Okay. And then I'm going back over here because it says missing water. I'll put it on here. Flesh missing. Got it. Okay. The last thing we gotta do is get some flesh. Uh, are you... Are you ready for the what? code? X, Y, Z. One, two, three, X, Y, Z. Okay, yeah. ready, ready, ready. Three, X, two, Z, one, Y. All right. Okay. I don't understand. Here we go. I got, I got instructions for you, Jacob, all right? Okay. Step one, add liquids in the following order. Ac got it. Acid, water, coffee. Oh, I, I messed up. I messed up. Okay. Acid. Nope. Water, sorry, I messed up. I messed coffee. up. I'm sorry. Acid, water, hot coffee. Got it. Are you ready for the next code? Yep. It's 1Y3X2Z. Okay. <laughs> Step, I understand. step two, if flesh is triangular, okay, what 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 shape is the flesh? Triangular, rectangular, or oval? It's definitely not oval. It, I think if I had to guess, it's a triangle. How do you not know if it's a triangle or a rectangle? <laughs> it's it's in a petri dish, and it looks like some of it is cut off. Is there but three what, points? What, is there three points or four points? <laughs> there's three points, but from what is cut off, there could be a fourth point. Okay, well, we're going to say three, so... Oh, no, yeah. do I have to remember? Okay. Charger sauce. Um, <laughs> okay. I th Charger sauce? I don't remember. Uh, so, it's water. Oh, boy. What's the black liquid? That the Is it coffee? Water, coffee, hot coffee. So, just regular coffee first? Yes. Okay, that was good. Good job. Okay. Good guess. <laughs> good guess. Jesus. Two Z one X three Y. Step three, baby. Okay. Ooh. Oh god. All right. Is it is there hair, pimples, or is it smooth? It's smooth. Smooth like a baby butt, boy. Okay. I'm gonna say hot acid. Water and then coffee. Regular water, regular coffee. 
Oh. 1Y2X3Z. Okay. Looks like there's a, a lady part here. Step four. <laughs> Step four. <laughs> uh, eyes, mouth, or ear? It's the ear, right, you said? I'm going to say that's a mouth, but it looks like the lady part. Uh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Regular yeah. acid and then two regular waters. Oh, it's starting to move. It's complete, it says. <laughs> Is there another code or something? Oh, my God. It's like squirming around. <laughs> it is. It's literally, it's literally sliding around the room. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and now I can get sucked up. Get in there. That's disgusting. All right. What do I? What's now? What now? All right. Well, I I got flushed now. Okay. Uh, the clock again. Ah. Uh, red, red, white. It's climbing the ceiling again. Red, white, and gray yeah, yeah, or whatever. Yeah. Okay. The white is on twelve. Black is on seven. Red is on ten. Okay. I see him as bone. All right. He grew flesh. You got flesh. He's all flattened, though. He's all. He's it's all smooth. He's, and he's, he got sucked dry. We need to give him some blood. Uh. Okay. Yeah. I got a. I got a valve, and I see, I know exactly what to do with it. So there's a little. The last slot I have is the the valve of blood. Oh. So I'm gonna put the valve on this little. Found a butterfly. Put the valve on this um thing. Twist it. Okay. Sucking up blood and putting it inside the box somewhere. Um, uh... Oh, I got... Oh, that was kind of cool. I opened up a container that has um, a lever. I just opened up a vent. A giant butterfly came out. I had to keep hitting it around the room, and it killed the rat. Oh, a giant butterfly killed the rat? It killed the rat, but inside the rat was the other key for the other cabinet door. <laughs> oh, that's weird. Okay, I'm gonna pull this lever. I'm gonna open up this cabinet. Oh, okay. I got like a little wheel thing. I know where that goes. Okay. I press the lever, open the container. There's like a pressure valve and like a, a pump thing. Um. So in that second cabinet, there's a box, a lock box that says Vanderboom, a coat, and uh, this like little like wheel thing that I can insert into here. I'm guessing turn it. There we huh. go. And okay, it, so oh. I have this. Yeah, a... You seeing some symbols? Yes. So I pressed this lever, okay. and and then like a, an S came up, and the pressure valve went to the max, and it slowly started going down. So it's like timed almost. And I see eight symbols. Okay, I see the eight symbols. Do I have to click the S? Okay. Um. So tell me what I guess when you're is there like oh, an order for them or something? Okay. So you, you see different symbols than me, maybe? I, I see the symbols, but I have an on and off button. When I hit the on button, the pressure uh, valve yeah. the pressure valve goes all the way to the right. Right, that's what mine does too. So I bet I okay. see the symbol you're supposed to press, you see the symbol I'm supposed to press. Okay, we're gonna hope so. Alright, okay. I'm gonna turn it on. On the count of three, turn it on, I'll hit the S. Okay. Alright, one Two, three. S. Nope, it's not an S. It's two triang two two rectangles. All right. Well, then we already messed up because. <laughs> okay, I guess it changes every time. Okay. Oh, the thing on the right resets it. Okay. All right. Tell me when you're ready. All right. Ready. One, two, three, go. What All right. It's it? a circle with like a. It's like a scope, like a scope sight. What do you see? Got it. A uh, person. Okay. Now what, what's next? I don't know. Jonathan, tell me what's next. <laughs> then nothing came out. Nothing else happened. Okay. Oh. Okay. So, is there, uh, next to the, uh, the like the pressure gauge? Is there like a thing that you can push down? Yeah. Okay. You need to push that down after you hit. Uh. Okay. Thing. Okay. All right. Ready. One, two, three, 
Okay. Uh, a, a square cut in half, <laughs> like down the middle. A deer with antlers. Okay, a T. The person. Okay, scope sight. A bird. All right, a line with a circle on the left. A house. Uh, a square with a T inside of it. A tree. Upside down cross. A heart. You got the easy symbols. Uh, a line on the bottom with this ball on top of it. A butterfly? Okay, an S. Uh, I. Got it. Yeah, I got the blood. Eh, my box is leaking blood. Oh, yeah, I can see it. it's dripping. Alright, I'm putting... Putting the... Giving this guy blood. It leaked all over the voodoo doll. Oh. Interesting. Okay, ready for the clock thing? Yep. The red is on three... The white is on five, and the black is on nine. Okay. Oh, I saw the whole thing covered in blood. Oh, he yep. has hair and stuff now. Yeah. I see his left oh, cheek. Oh, lord and lord. I went back to that black box, I put a candle in there, and then, like, a guy just came across. Okay, now I have a... I got a hex key. What do I have to open with this, though? I remember seeing a hex key slot. Oh, here, here, the top one. Okay. I'm gonna open up this hex key slot. I bet you're gonna give me another, like, 3x3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, Yeah, six, it is. I, I got, like, a, it's like a telescope, but it has a 3x3 symbol on it. Okay, so what, what's, like, oh, what do I need to push down? Well, I don't know, actually, because there's different ones. What do I need to look, what do you say you're looking at? You say you're looking at I a candle? Okay, yeah, 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 there's a candle. Okay. So if you're looking at, if you're like, looking at the candle, ones, just, yeah. then it's um, two, six, eight. Two, six, eight. Lights flickered. Yeah. You, is there, like, one for a person? Like a hand holding a person? Is that, is that ring a bell? You know, like a person a clock. Uh, the broken vase. Candle. The only thing I see is two chess pieces. Okay, do that one. Okay. Four. Eight, nine. Okay, now a clock. I see the guy crawling around, or I did. Okay. One, two... Eight. Do you see a rose? I see a broken vase. There's a rose there on the floor. Okay. One, two, seven, nine. Oh, Lord, he looks like he's suffering. <laughs> now what? Oh, I don't know if I was supposed to do that. Oh, he's broken out. He's okay. He's alive. alive! He's crawling around. Oh, I see oh, him. He's running God. around on my screen, too. It's you, my daughter. That's not creepy at it all. It seems much time what has passed. What have you done? He's... So, okay, so you know that one place where I said there was a coat? Yeah. Um, I clicked on that because it was rumbling around. He put on the coat and the jacket. Oh. And then he said, it's you, my daughter. Much time has passed. Yes. You have brought me back to life. You have brought me back but to life. we are not finished but yet. we are not finished yet. Oh no, so that means there's a chapter oh, three. God. We are all trapped in the cubes, in the cubes we have created. We have, created. <sighs> we have to find a way out. We have to find a way out. Look into my pocket. 
Look into my pocket. Why can't you look into your pocket? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you ready for another code? Uh, what kind of code? The XYZ123? Yes, sir. Okay. 3XY21Z. Okay, I got a letter, a note. When I open my eyes in the future, I will wear a mask and I will show you the gems. Only then can we escape the queue we are trapped in. Some of these words are underlined again, so maybe the chalk again? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So I see eyes, future, mask, gems, and cube. Okay, I got a key. Oh, where did he go? Stuff's making sound in here. Oh god, he's just standing there. That's so weird. Oh. Alright, uh, so that key, I can unlock that box where that guy was hiding in. This compartment opened and a butterfly came out of it. Where's it going? Is he technically, is he technically like our dad? <gasps> okay. But... I got a show mask, an antler, and a real mask. So the a butterfly came out and it landed on this spot of a butterfly? Uh-huh. And then now these three compartments opened up. They're like three chest looking pieces and they have slots where it looks like gems are supposed to go. Give me a mask. Where gems are supposed to go. Okay, um so you know those three masks that I got? I have a half mask, a like a antler mask, okay. a deer mask, and a show mask. So that's what I that's what the pieces look like I'm seeing. I have a half one with half a mask. Yep. One with like antlers and one with just like a normal looking one, I guess. Yeah, okay. So then when I click on our dad, I guess I think he's our dad, right? Yeah. Or is he our husband? No, he's our dad. Okay. Give when I he mask. says give me a mask. Is there one that's like standing out? I just don't know what I'm supposed to do with these. Does this say anything on it? So, I don't know. I feel like I'm supposed to put a gym in there. Are you, are you to, are you... Oh! Um... That was creepy. Okay. I feel like there's need more information or I need to find where something else is at. You might have to find where something else is at, because all this guy's telling me is, uh, give me, give him a mask. You need to find out what mask to give him. As far as I can tell, I can't do anything with these. I don't want to give him a mask randomly. Well, I would say it's the one with the half a mask. That's the only one that has a mask on it. That's the only one that what now? That has like a like that looks like it's a mask to me. I mean, I could tell you the order they're in for me. It's like the plain looking one, the antlered one, and then the half one. Mm. I don't know if that means anything. The order. I'm not sure. Do you, should I just give him the half mask then? I think so. Try it, I guess. I don't know what's gonna happen. He's gonna like kill you or something. It the screen changed color and he's like Oh. Look around the room. Yeah, I don't wanna do that. Okay. Um Every I gave him all three masks. Um, um okay. when I give him the half mask, music starts playing and he starts just like swaying back and forth. Yeah. When I give okay. him the full mask, regular mask, uh -huh. there's like a screeching sound and the screen turns like almost white, but I can still see him. Okay. And now for the scariest one. 
the antler mechan mask, I give him that. And the screen turns red, blood starts dripping, and he says, look around the room. Did you look around the room? No, I was scared. <laughs> Come on! You got ready to, it's trying to code or something. <laughs> there is a code on the chalkboard. Like a piano code or something? Uh, No, no, it's the one where three vertical lines with the ticks. Okay. Uh, The first one is on the last tick. Okay. Second one is on the second to last tick. And the last one is on the first tick. Okay, there's one gym. The red, it's the red gym, so I'm guessing that goes for the... He has the antler mask on? Yeah. Okay. So... Oh, uh, I put I that mean... in and he got closer to the table. He's like coming closer to me. Okay. So... So I guess what happens when you put in the regular mask? So it starts swaying? Okay, when I gave him the full mask, it took me to, like, the clock with the white, black, and red, uh, lines. Okay. So, the black one is on the two, the red one is on the five, and the white one is on the eleven. Oh, uh, he's standing behind you. I see him. I see you swaying. Ah! He popped out from behind you. Ah. Are you looking through like a little people or what? Yeah, I'm looking through like the lens thing like, like like you did. I got a voodoo needle. So I'm gonna go to this voodoo doll now. I just have to stab it or something. Okay. <clears throat> you guys poked him in the eye. Ew, what did you do that for? That's what it made me do. And then the chest popped open and it gave me a jewel. What was that, the full mask? Yeah, I have the half mask on now. It's the piano one. Okay. He's close. Okay, what's the piano keys? You gotta tell me a number. Right? What do you mean? Wait, oh, wait, hold on. Oh, never mind. It's uh, F, G, D, C. Okay, I got the golden gem now. I'm gonna put it in the half mask. Okay, they're all spinning around. Ah. It made a golden key pop up and he grabbed it. Okay, I, I see that, that, that 3x3 grid again. Uh, okay. He's making a creepy sound and I don't like it. Okay, one, three, four, five, six. Okay, I was able to grab the black cube again. That's all there was. Uh, oh, I bet I could give it to him. Oh, my God. Yeah, that was weird. He said the future in the past, the past in the future. There is a way out. I gave him the cube. The past and the future, the future and the past. A Click him again. Inside a cube. To the lake where we belong. There is a way out. To the lake where we both belong, my daughter. If the three gems are found and the golden cube is revealed in the past. It says, give me the black cube in the future. That's what he said to me. Look closely into the cube I hold. I did that already. I told you the keys. Both of you, press and hold the middle of the cube for 10 seconds at the same time. Alright. Ready? Ready? Yeah. One, One, two, three. Oh, it's working. I'm going inside the cube. It's working. I'm going to... Whoa, I see you holding the I see you cube. holding the black cube. I, I let go, by the way. I just... Now I'm going into the golden cube, and I see the black cube. It's going back and forth between the golden cube, black. And I see the black cube, and I see the golden cube, and I see the black cube. <laughs> <laughs> it 
this is cool. And then everything went dark. Is that it? Is that the end? Must be. You've reached the end. Has the other person also reached the end? Yes. The loop is broken. The loop is broken. The, the gap, gap is, is closed. closed. Time doesn't exist in the lake. The future and the past blend together. You and the other person are the same. We are the same. Very similar. You both belong to the lake now. Yeah, I'm the old girl. Like We're gonna high five. Will blossom. <laughs> oh no, we just merged. We're a oh. tree. So we just died? We save our dad and he kills us? Very beautiful like tree, that's though. That's not the point of the story. There's that butterfly. Oh, that's it. Yeah, that's it. Past oh. within. That was the Pass Within by Rusty Lake. Shout out to Rusty Lake. Come on the show. <laughs> Come on the show. <laughs> Not even a show. I know. <laughs> no, yeah, that was that was a fun game. Shout out to them. That's cool. It was cool. actually pretty cool. Like, yeah. Well, that was fun. We'll that was find... fun. We need to find more games like that or something to do. Yeah, that's what I was just thinking too. Well, guys, there's oh. another hour for you. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this different type of content. Probably will be seeing some more of it if we can find some. If you guys have any suggestions, let it uh, let us know in the comment section. Yeah, throw it in the comments. Follow us on Instagram. Follow us on TikTok at Denny Bros Gaming. Um, Order yourself some Dubby. Use Denny Bros Ten at checkout for ten percent off. Thank you for watching. We love you, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Ha, ha, ha.